Okay, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of Farm Management with Jay. So, since the last video, there has been a slight improvement in the fan. Jay has decided he's going to go into production of making soup. So that is, you know, using products such as potatoes, carrots, parsnip, and uh, a few other ingredients that they may be required, uh, you know. Gonna do some, he's doing, currently doing some research for that. So he is slowly prepping his area and his farmland for, for that. He has ploughed most of the fields that he, he needs ploughed before growing his crops. He's still got a few grass fields because he needs to continue to cut grass and grow grass and cut grass for his, for his production of, you know, silage. So he's making silage. To be able to you know, put into his into his BTA to make his electricity charge, so he's making a bit of you know a bit of profit off of that when he sells the electricity charge to the to the to the local uh, electricity board. So he has he has actually you know done quite a bit actually. He's, he, he's plotted on. He's made a little bit of money. He's also um started to build his production production yard area he has a, a factory for farm supplies so he's now making his own seed he can make silage in there he's also started uh, to make his own uh, fertilizer as well so he can you know fertilize fields when he's you know when he needs to so that's absolutely great he's doing quite well on that so without further ado let's get into it and i'll show you the you know how his land is developed and his you know he's changed a few things on his farmyard got a few extra buildings so let's just jump into it and i will give you a quick guided tour of what's you know what's been updated okay so jay has got a new farm uh, farmhouse Got a new new one he's updated that got a new new little farmhouse here yeah he's got some nice new furniture in there as well he's got table chairs got a kitchen area back there got a living room so he's 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 in the process of picking up when he can he's going to get some landscapers in put a nice little path from from his uh, path here, from the front of his farm, maybe coming down this way, down this, the side of the shed here, <coughs> down the side of the shed, and then maybe go straight down there, straight down there maybe, because otherwise, you know, he's got to get them into, put some gravel down at the front of this yard, yeah, this shed here. Where he's got his his powers at the moment. So we'll go down here. This is yeah, we'll cut through here. So yeah, there's not not much really changed down here. Um, this 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 part of the this part of the yard, uh, farmyard is is still the same. The entrance is going to be you know, slightly changed when when there's when he can. He's going to get this bush here, maybe these couple this bush here, or these couple of bushes here, right on the entrance here, because it kind of does come out into the lane a little bit. Um, removed. That's the plan there. He has actually, uh, this bit here was where his existing farmhouse used to be. But obviously he's now moved it over towards that, kind of out of the way. The EGA is still there. Also got himself a little jet wash. For washing off his equipment. He's also had a tap installed, an outdoor tap installed, so he can fill up with water and and things for his products that he needs. 
So this area is still kind of, kind of, you know, fine. So what we'll do is we'll jump in the, uh, jump in the little, in this Land Rover and I'll take you up for, for a little tour. Take a little Grand Land Rover over. Next door. Take his little, he'll take a drive in his little Land Rover. Beacon song. We'll be going out onto the main road in a minute. Get rid of that. Out the view. There we are. We'll take you, take you for a little drive around. Yeah. Take you up to the production yard so we, you can see you know, his production yard being in development. So he's, you know, not a little, well, it's, it's kind of at the end, right at the end of his kind of land. He's done it for a reason, so it gives him a bit more kind of, you know, a bit more like, you know, a, you know time to kind of get stuff up there and cut stuff about. Fellow, one of his fellow farmers has been busy up here with the forestry. Oh, no, there's a thing. Things down here. Yep, that's it. He's also, Jay's also had some uh, landscaping work done on Field 44. He's put in a, a track, oh, put in a track up the sides of 44 and got access into Field 55. So we're just going into here, into, into right here, this is the open area. Well, this is the start of his production area. Okay. We'll just jump out of the vehicle here. This is this is Jay's start of his production yard. This is his farm farm supply factory. Where we go, here we are. So he's he started filling it up to be able to make. You know, his, his product, he started making some products. Nothing's currently running at the moment. Um, because he's, he's just, you know, he's trying to kind of get it up, you know, fill it up and stuff. He filled up the water yesterday. Five million litres of water. That took a little bit while to, uh, to kind of fill up. He started putting some grass in to be able to make it silage. So he started making silage. As you can see, he's got just over 8,000 litres of that. He started making digestate. He and um, he's also started making liquid fertilizer because the cedar and planter that Jay wants to get uses liquid fertilizer instead of solid. So he started making liquid fertilizer for that. So it's yeah, it's, it's coming along. Um, <coughs> this water trailer here. So it is coming along. 
It is half past nine at night on the 2nd of December. So he has started kind of, you know, started running that. So we'll, what we'll do, we'll bring it up and we will start running some stuff. You can pick up that stuff running. Yep, making some silage and some digestate. This one here. We've got grass. And um, yeah. So we're using the digestate make the liquid fertilizer. So we'll activate that one. That. What we'll do is we'll pop back down to the farm now and we'll uh, Check on the progress of the electricity and things like that. Top it up at the BGA. Also, um, we might. They might have to have a chat with his fellow fellow farmer up here, fellow farm landowner up here, Mr. Viking. Um, uh, maybe you know, see if we can kind of you know, come to you know, some kind of arrangement about having the the track along here made from a dirt track, maybe into gravel or you know, something like that. The land, the land, uh, the, the, the track in between the fields that Jay owns, <coughs> that would be fine. It's just like this little bit here. Because Jay does actually, it's kind of joint ownership of the track. We look onto this map here. I'm currently sat up here at the moment. Obviously Jay owns this field, this field, so he owns this half of the track. But the other half of the track. From the start of 69 up to 70, up to the actual main road, is owned by Mr. Viking. So we, you know, there is there is plans for that one. He's also um also uh, we'll show, we'll show you the access into we'll go up to 44 and I'll show you the access that he's had made and uh, put in to be able to get into 55. Because we had, um, he did, yeah, Jay had a, a look around in, you know, when it was daylight. He you know, had a couple of other of the fellow farmland owners come and have a, a, a bit of an investigation to see if he could, they could help locate the entrance into 55. But it wasn't, it wasn't, you know, anywhere to be found at all. We, we tried, we looked in all the active other areas. We looked into 44, we looked into 45. 57 and 56 and also 54 we had a look in case it might have been a, a, a connection an entrance just off one of the other fields but there wasn't any so they've had it put into in, from 44 i'll go down there and i'll show you i'll show you what's what's been done down there indicate here i know there's probably not many much traffic coming but common courtesy just to indicate just so when there is fairly other members on there is somebody else on the server i believe not too sure who but i will have a look in a minute but we're just it's just common courtesy just to kind of indicate and just to let other users know 
where you, which which direction you're planning on going. We are now on the 2nd of December as you can see. So we have just started the winter, winter seasons. He's just actually gone past the engine. Hang on. He just drove past his prime name engine. Which is actually showing, uh, it's, it's a shared lane, shared lane, um, with the outreach program, the outreach program farm. That's why it's kind of, you know, rather up, up as far as sort of Jay's area here. Um, I've got a gravel track, and then I think it's just, just here that it goes back to a farm, farm, you know, muddy farm track because obviously that is the farmland and farmyards for the outreach program. Over along. Find an area that I might be able to turn around here. I think. Okay. Let's just turn these beacons off a minute. Well, I'm on a bit of farm track, so it's alright, I don't necessarily need it. There's the owner of the Outreach Program, Mr. Brandon. Oh, yeah. There is the entrance of... This is the landscaping that and the gravel track that you know, Jay had put in at the edge of 44 here. At the edge of 44 here, so we'll be getting 55. So yeah, 55 is the big field. Uh, we have got obviously we cut the grass, but he's just waiting to. Um, just waiting for the, the grass to obviously you know, the, the rain to stop to be able to finish collecting the grass in. It's obviously collecting it in the rain, it does actually just reduce the, the yield. So we want to try and kind of get as much yield from the grass as we can so we can continue to make the silage. Let's just go back to the, down to the farm, check on the BGA, top up the silos if need be. So 
what we'll do is we'll park the Land Rover back in the, in the shed. I don't know if I can see out the window. No. No. Okay. We'll have to do it from this view so we can reverse back in there. Give me a... Okay. Put the big working lights on so it's a bit more seeing. Shed. It's like to turn here in it. Okay, and the shed light. Oh, didn't quite activate it. Okay, close that one down. Top up the side of this a little bit. Let me jump around here. Because I'm here. I can't do it from the menu, but because I'm here, I'm just gonna go in. I'll start that one running, just so we can continue to make the electricity drive, and then digest it. Um, we're storing the methane at the moment, because we, you know, we can store the methane. So we're distributing the digest rate up to the farm supply factory. So the digest rate is being supplied up to the farm supply factory, so we can make the liquid fertilizer. The silage is being made up at the farm supply factory, so we don't need to worry about that now. The other one that we did have, the custom farm silo that we had originally, or which I had originally over here, uh, that was over here, next to the seeds, we've actually now kind of, you know, sowed off. We sowed the building, a bit, you know, so it's somebody else. We've got the building because we no longer need it because we can now make a silage and everything in the farm supply factory. And the electricity charge that we, you know, we do make. So we've got 828 litres at the moment of electricity charge. Whatever you've got of the electricity charge on the hour, every hour does get sold so you get a little bit of a profit in an in income every hour <coughs> every hour when it does you know when it's made so as you can see i've got the yeah, jay's got 229,052 pounds in the bank so and he's just got over a thousand liters of electricity so when it goes 10 o'clock should get if he should get a little bit of income coming for the electricity charge that he just produced. So I'll just hope by a minute just so we can. Yep. It's gone up a little bit, but he is, it didn't get a lot. But he got, you know, what, it's gone up by about 950 pounds, something like that, maybe. Maybe a bit more, just over a thousand pounds. He's now got 229,798. So that will now produce electricity charge for the next hour. 
to whatever has been made uh, the next hour, so at 11 o'clock, will then get sold, and that's the type of income, that's the income that he will make. So obviously the more he can make, then the more he can make, the more he, you know, he will kind of, you know, benefit from. This, you see income here, uh, see production that he's got here. Um, I might actually reconsider it and kind of, you know, do away with because I can make seeds in the farm supply factory. Yeah, you can make seeds up there, so we might sell all this. So we, and then we've got a bit of space here to put something else, maybe. I'm not too sure what yet though, so that's something I can kind of, yeah, maybe another shed for equipment at some point. Um, maybe another vehicle shed. Another vehicle shed like this, where we can draw a combine and stuff, maybe. Yeah, so it's kind of in, out the way, and dry. Maybe put another shed like this down. Get another shed like this built, so we can uh, put the equipment in here. Um, so yeah, we might pick up those seeds. Might pick up those seeds and put them into storage. Eighteen thousand six hundred and seventy seven litres of sea. Put there. <coughs> Let's put it into the other side though, and then maybe empty that silo out, and then we can perhaps do away with that one. I was Dave was going to put seeds into a separate silo, but to be honest with you, he's got his little one there for you know, filling up his you know, cedar when he gets it. Um. So I might just put it into this side though, because it's got a bigger holding capacity. Might might fill this uh, fill the tray empty this side though. Oh, stuck on the pallets up there. Look. Oh, there we are. So yeah, we might actually empty this side though, and maybe remove it and then perhaps put in a storage or liquid fertilizer. I'm 
Tomorrow we're in here, we do have tea. Need to find it on the menu. Probably some apple, there. Box, oh, no, store, fast, sausage. Somewhere, there they are. I'd say they should be there somewhere. So we'll just move them from this side actually and put them into the main one. Just, yeah, we'll just move this about up here. Oh, it stopped raining. Happy day. It stopped raining, so that's good. Because that means, you know, give it sort of half an hour or so to dry up a little bit. And then we should be able to get your shape so you should be able to continue pick it, collecting in this grass from 55. So we'll give it, uh, we'll, we'll transfer the seeds across and then that should give the ground a little bit of, uh... Oh, Just empty the last little bit of seed in there. There we are. Kill the engine a little bit just so he saves the fuel. So let's that silo now is empty. There was any seeds in the silo. Yep, silo's now empty. Okay, so what we'll do is we will we'll pull the demolition guys in. Let's rotate this bit. Make sure that to make sure that they're getting rid of the right thing. So demolish, and we need to clear that silo. Oh, we can demolish it and get rid of it, and we gain £7,500. Yes, I think we will very much. Right, so we need some storage for liquid. Don't know if there's one like this liquid silo. Uh, for Let's have a look. A little one like this for the liquid fertilizer. Have a look. It might be. Sure. If we find some store. By liquid fertilizer. Feed silo. Tail silo. Oh, 
construire quelqu'un. Hmm. The boat. But it doesn't say with lit. Boat. I'm not sure about that. Wonderful look at this. Ooh. Small universal underfloor liquid storage. Okay. Single. Okay, so that one you can put multiple one in. This one's just for single. And you've got medium one. medium one uh, a large one which has got a 10 million leaflet capacity Ooh. thing is you could be making a lot of liquid that like so So if we're going to put one of these in, it's going to take uh, 100,000 million, million litres. That one. Single. Because. If we only put single, that means I can only, you can only store one type of liquid. If you go for the bigger one. We could then put the liquid fertilizer and any other liquid products that you might make on um also to be extra stay up extra storage fuel. I think <coughs> I think we're held off for this storage at the moment until they makes a bit more money selling the electricity when we make a bit more money from the electricity we could yeah we'll we'll do that we'll put that one down but what we might do is instead of putting it there might actually put it over here next to this one next to the main silo and then we've got the main silo and then we've got the liquid storage here next to it the other side of the flooder yeah the other side of the floodlight put the liquid storage in here So then, when we're earning, yeah, obviously going into the seeds, you know, growing seeds and stuff, you'll be able to just come in and then pick it up, drop it off. Yeah, that might be the, might be the best plan. Do? What might do then? Is one thing and we've got a little bit of solid fertilizer in there. Yeah, I was going to say if that one was empty, because we've got that one moved and then put over here. So it's kind of like more level next to seats, but that's something yeah we can kind of yeah, develop on. And then we can produce a bit more boat. I'd have a bit of a boat coming up here. Oh. 
ไปกินเฉดแดเน้นเหลวภาพกันได้ความเห่าสิทธิเลือดอีกอสเตอร์อีกเฉดตักนThat might be a good investment. Because then I could distribute the water up to the farm supply factory that it requires, and then anything helps. Might be good investment. Where could we actually place? <coughs> let's have a. Let's, yeah, we can. Yeah, let's place one. That's place. Place it there, and we could top it up, get that running, and then that will distribute. So that might be a good investment. That would save me having to run up and down all the time to fill up my fact. My productions that require water. Yes, I think that might be a good investment. We'll place one of them. That's actually a good investment. Let's go and see. We need to build it up. Build it up. Build it up. Ten thousand each. Well, it doesn't cost anything. Funny either. And it's twenty-four thousand. 24 cycle per month, and it don't cost anything to run. Happy day. So we input the water. Input water and it comes. So fill this up. Because we've got a tap here. Yeah, we'll go up and get them. Do we need this? We get rid of Because we make it, we're going to be making seats up at the farm supply factory. So we could get rid of that equipment, make a bit of, make a bit of money off of that. Wouldn't we? That's a financial decision I think well made there, Jay. 
good man. Let's go and take this to the shop. Because if we take it down to the shop and sell it, we can get a little bit extra money for it, rather than selling it. Because we sell it from here. Uh, okay. So if we sell it from here, we get 57,000. 57,178 and we get 5,807 5, if we was to sell this container from here. So let's take it down to the shop and see what we get when we go um, yeah, from, from there. See what, or how much extra we're going to get. Might only be a little bit more, but it might be yeah, it'd be worth kind of getting a little bit extra. So it's just changed into the it's just changed into the in cab view because it's when when driving down the lane in the dark, it's a little bit easier. You can see where you're going a bit better. Oh, it's got my beacons on. We'll be going out onto the main main road in a minute. Looks like the sun's coming up here, look. It's quarter to 11 at night, though, and it looks like the sun's coming up. He's kind of new. What on earth is it? a new building. Oh. Somebody's put a bit of storage on it. Never hear that in the corner. Oh, there we are. Oh. Yeah, I don't know what kind of camera view this I mean, so I don't know, I'm still at the side. Oh, on the back of the... Okay, so it's kind of like got a back. Back bit. A little bit. On the front. Looks like I've got a camera view on the front. Okay. Weird. Never noticed that before. Let's just line this up a bit more. So it's in the box. Line it up a little bit more so in the box. Can I get a bit? <coughs> oh, hang on. There we go. That's a wrong, wrong tool select. Right, so let's just jump out and see what. Yeah. So it was fifty-seven thousand for the actual trailer bit, wasn't it? And just over five thousand for, for the. Um, yeah, see, we get six thousand three hundred and eighty-seven for the container. So it's about an extra, about an extra four hundred pound, four five hundred pound. Can you bring it down to the shop? So yeah, we'll sell that. Um, it's an extra, 
Yeah, it's about an extra five grand, isn't it? But because it's fifty-seven thousand, just over fifty-seven thousand for it back there from the from the menu. Have a look. Fifty-six thousand four hundred and one pounds. Fifty-six thousand four hundred. And if we sell it here, it's sixty-two. So sixty-two four zero one minus fifty-six. Sixty-two zero forty minus fifty-six four zero one. Yeah, five thousand six hundred and forty pound extra. So just over an extra five and a half thousand pounds. So yes, we'll have that. Thank you. We'll sell that. So it's an extra bit of profit. I'm back into the bank balance. Thank you very much. So we'll go up and get the water through it now. Go up and get the water trailer from the farm factory. Take it back to the main yard. Take it back to the main farm yard so we can start filling up our water tubes, yeah? I did see, I think I did see in the menu, in the construction menu, something about a weather, weather something to do with the weather. I think it's something like, it forecasts the weather, so we can kind of see what it's going to, going to go out, what weather's going to be like, gives it, you know, a, a bit of a forecast. Might have a look at that in a minute. If we can kind of place, like, you know, something to forecast the weather, that would be good. Not too sure how it will work, but it's something we can look into. Tell me. Tell me, chat. Look into that. Made a bit more money off the electric, but it looks a bit slow, look. Happy days. We're working right now. See what we do. Go. Go. 
Okay. Hi. Hi, Ma. Hello. Hello. Let's get. Okay. The big one. Thanks for sweet steering, okay? So we'll take this down and put it into our water distributor. Start that running, maybe. See how that goes. That'd be good, wouldn't it? See how much water it takes to fill up. I don't mind filling up the water to chip there, that would be, yeah, you know, that's on the farm, yeah. He still has to think of a name for his farm. So we're not I'm not too sure what we're gonna be calling the farm yet. So yeah, what he's gonna call this farm. So well what I might do Ah, oh, I've gone past it again look. <laughs> Nothing on this field yet, so just borrow Mr. Gav and Mr. J's yeah, to me to you, I think. Or to me to you, uh, yeah, to me to you. We'll just borrow their field, a bit of field entrance a minute just to swing round. I'm sure they won't mind. There's only a power field, they've not got no crops in there. If they had crops in their fields and it was growing, I would have gone down to the shop just to swing around. But I'm sure it would be, it would be absolutely fine. Just to swing around there and their engines. I'm sure they won't have an issue. What we'll do is we'll take, I'll take that seed treater down well um yeah so we'll see how much we get for it if we set it up here and then we'll go yeah. let's change this view now turn the front working lights off the mic yeah we're on the farm and the will get up water so we'll just fill this up Let's just have a look and see how full that is. Okay, so it's probably... No. Oh, 
five hundred thousand, I would say, give or take. I would say about another trailer and a half. I'll tell you what we're talking about, could we? Just, oh, we can kill the beacons now. Turn the beacons off because we're back on the farmyard. Private farmland, we can turn the beacons off. <coughs> so let's just change the camera view. So, we've got this one. Oh, so it does. It might have just, might have just been because it will. Might have been how I had the camera, maybe. Uh, yeah, now it's just... Now it's just kind of... Yeah, or maybe it might have been because we were close to the building. Not too sure. Might have also been the trailer that we had on. Give it a, a gif, an extra thing. Oh, keep there with me. Guys, why we just synchronize data with other players? We do have a uh, farmer, we have a farmer owner, Mr. J, uh, who is one of the co-owners of Jamita U, a farmland. So he's coming on to obviously check her you know, bits and pieces. But I think I what I'll do I'll fill up this water production. I'll fill up the water distributor and get that one going and I think I will be ending this video there pretty soon. Yeah, we've been about forty minutes or so. Been a bit more than that. It's been an hour the video's about an hour long. I don't want to make it too long. Try to make videos about half hour, 40 minutes long, maybe an hour maximum, I think. So it gives you, you know, gives chance of getting stuff done. But, yeah, top the water up, get that one going. It takes a little while for it to fill up. It is 200,000 litres of water. So it takes a little while to fill up. But it should kind of help out a little bit with distributing the water. I think it's got 10,000 litres every hour, maybe. It should keep stuff topped up. So. Why is that? Okay, we've got forty five thousand, so we've church so reduced it's about 30,000, just over 30,000, 75 litres running, yeah, fine. That's cool. So 
we've got 6,890, 98, 6,985 litres of electric charge at the moment. It's going up, as, as I'm stood here, look, it's going up, so it's, you know, it's doing quite well. Is that finished? Yep, that's finished. Right, it's just confusing. What well, might do actually? That if I can I might move to get this tap moved, get the plumber in. I might get the plumber in. <coughs> get the plumbing company in actually, and. Uh, Maybe put it up here. It put up here. Or up here at the end of this bit. It's like we've got it down there, but just up here. So then, <laughs> then, hopefully, if I can position the water trailer in the right place, I can fill up the trailer, fill up that. Well, at the same time. Well, not at the same time, but fill it up and then it, it fill, it, uh, fill up the water dispenser. Yes, that might be an idea. Actually, let's let's have a look at that. Five hundred pounds, I think. It. I'm not really gonna use it.
be putting a thing. What type of fencing do you think we go for people? So that, put that one there, which is kind of like a, a wired, wired fence by the looks of it, isn't it? A couple of posts with some wiring on it. Or shall we go for an actual fence gate? An actual fence like this? Go for wooden like this? Like, like a na natural wood or we go for white fencing? But oh, metal thing. That's metal. Is that metal? No, it's a wooden round pole. I think that's just a post and then a, a, quite a beam across the top. Hmm. Got a gate to go yet? Got a gate to go. I don't want to put a gate. That is. That's kind of like the, a mesh fence, isn't it? Hmm. Got a fight like that. That Clyde, have I? Might have to move it back. Move it back. What is it, guys? The head. I think it's under... There you go chat. Yeah, that's it. And what we'll do is we'll go back to landscaping, painting.
Now look at that chat. Okay. Painted, wasn't it? Put the new tap in here. Get in the field. Where you getting them? In there, isn't it? Thank you. Uh, yeah, I'll just, yeah. Not gonna allow me to do it, but that looks good. Tight. That looks nice. ID. It would have been nice. Ah, oh, it's a very tasty. It's a very tasty. In the back of the fence. So, it don't matter. It don't matter. Looks good. I think it'll be a fast there about right. <coughs> Activate that, that will start that running. And that should start distributing water. Oh, hang on. Oh, yeah. 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 So we're distributing the water now.
So we've got 17,145 pounds. Well, 17,145 litres of electric charge. Gone up a bit more than that, but. It's quite a bit, yeah, it makes quite a bit of electricity charge in, in an hour. It's quite a lot of electricity charge in an hour, isn't it? Right, let's have a look and see how much we get to sell that. There, each one. 29,560 pounds. Sell it here. It's got some seed additive in it, but, you know, <coughs> that's fine. Let's just go across here. Almost. So 18,570 litres. Eighteen thousand six hundred and sixty-five. We'll just hope over here for a couple of minutes, ch chat. Just to see what this actually does, how much it produces in an hour. Nine thousand two, uh, nine thousand two hundred and forty pounds. That's not bad. That's not. That's not bad. That's that's okay. It's about ten grand. Just short of ten grand. That that wasn't too bad. Was it? Okay. So what was it? Fifty something pound. Twenty nine thousand six. 560. Let's go and see what we can. I sell in the belt system. Let's go see what we can make by selling.
Let's see, so it's five twenty-nine thousand five hundred and sixty pounds of food from the menu. So we can get thirty-two thousand thirty-two thousand five hundred and fourteen. That's just just, you know, six pounds short of three grand. Yeah, thank you very much. I we'll love that. Just, just short of three grand extra. Just bringing it a little bit of a distance. Good day. Most of our other trailers are. Uh... Here we go. So we'll go with Jet Black. Most of our other trailers are Jet Black, so may as well stick with the colour theme. Jet Black with the future air wheels. Here we go. Happy days. 7,530 pounds. If you open thing. Um, and then Farm now. I see how much I've done it again. Look.
เสร็จไปไปเอ็นชินชินไมฟเอ็นเอ็นชินชินไมฟ I need to also clarify that field there. Um, the reason being, it doesn't actually like on the position farm. We have got some details, but it doesn't actually, actually show up. This, it, it, although it's a field, it's not identifying it as a field. Done that one, done that one, done this one. I need to plow this field and regrow it. So I need to kind of plow them or soil, take some soil sample. I need to take some soil samples, I think. See, I need to, yeah, some of these, this one might. Okay. Partly, partly, done it. I might have to plow them and then take soil sample. Tells you that. Because what it should do is it should tell you the compositions for like, like if we look down here, um, here on this particular map, they've got they've got a lot of the um, what their fields are. Like here, they've got loam and then sandy loam and then you've got loamy sand so it, it tells them and I think they've done the same over some of theirs over here on Oats Farm they've got some samples some of them tells us and others don't like with mine here tells me for this one tells me for this one doesn't tell me for this one or this one yet or this one might on that one but I think that's just grass at the moment so I need to I think I need to kind of plow them it give me the, it's give me the composition for that one that sandy loam that looks bit, yeah totally green sandy loam for that one there so, and, and that one there, I think I need to take samples on them, or plow them, so I can take samples. I think they have to be plowed, and then, yeah, so it identifies as a field. Anyway, let's take this. Fertilizer back to the farm. Here, brothers. Here, brothers. Yeah. 
man. Like, that's my day. There we are, ladies and gentlemen. I think I will end this video here. We're now back at the farm with the tractor. Um, Jay's done quite a little bit of work. Got some productions running. So yeah, look forward to seeing you all in the next video. If you are enjoying the content and stuff, that's absolutely great. And hit that like button, give me a thumbs up if you like the content, it helps me out a load and it also allows YouTube to, you know, see that it is likeable content and it will show it out to other, you know, other members of the public. If you, uh, do like the content and you like to kind of, you know, you want to find your way back, hit that subscribe button as well on the, on the channel and that will give you notifications every time there's a new video or new content on my channel. Or if I do ever do a, a go live streaming, it will show you that as well. And the best thing it is, it is completely free to you. Helps me out a ton, it really is appreciated. And it is completely free to you guys. So I will cut you out, I will catch you in the next one. And as usual, happy farming.